Hey guys, I just wanted to show you today just this technique that I picked up. I'm trying to give this table more of a rustic, um, distressed look. So I found this inspiration on Pinterest and I stripped it already and I whitewashed it and now I'm giving it a little bit of this dry brush effect. But I want it to feel very natural and very, um, as if it came off over time rather than I actually dry brushed it and you're seeing my strokes. So I just wanna show you the technique that I'm doing. My son's ho holding the camera for me right now so hopefully you'll be able to see everything really clearly. So I'm going over it like in a little bit of a circular movement and coming back the other way with the brush so this way it's a little bit more organic <clears throat> um, in design so you're not getting that straight on um, typical dry brush like this. And so as you can see, it kind of makes this circular motion, you know, shape here. And just continuing that, kind of really getting that paint in. And then I'm gonna take a paper towel. <clears throat> if you have a cloth, that would be great too. The paper towel seems to work fine for me. I'm just dabbing it and then going over in small circular motions around the edge of it. So this way it's you don't see those sharp edges from the paintbrush. And if you do have some, if you do get a couple, excuse me, get a little bit more paint, and then you're just gonna do it to the next side of it, just as you can see here. And then same thing. I'm gonna take the paper towel, circular motions, Dab a little bit, circular, so it really looks like it has been taken off during time and wear. Now, I will go back over this with some wax, but for right now, that's kind of the, uh, the look that I'm going for. So it really looks like it's come off. You're not seeing these typical brush strokes, which in dry brushing usually looks like. You could do a couple of them here and there on the table, you know, but you don't want the whole table to be done like that. And just do a couple strokes, circular motion, back and forth with your paintbrush, just like that. In some sections, if you want a little bit more paint, so that way it looks like it's more natural, you could do that. And then just some small strokes. Dab, rub, dab, rub, and that's that. Can't wait to show you the finished product. Thanks, Anthony.